All right, hi everyone, welcome to Timberborn. It's a new map, of course. The game's been updated a lot. All kinds of stuff has changed. And I wanted to go kind of opposite from what we did last time. So we're gonna do a new game. We're gonna do Folk Tales. We're gonna do a map I call Water World. That would be kind of the opposite of Badlands, right? We're gonna go next, and we're going to go Custom. Here's the thing, we're not gonna have any droughts. Zero droughts. And I don't think I have to touch temperate weather duration. And I don't know if this is going to mess it up or not. There's going to be no drought handicap. We're going to leave everything else the same. Building fund rate 75%. I assume that's the default. Starting water is going to be zero. Starting food water consumption because we're on the water world. And uh, it's I assume it's going to be hot. Although it's a fresh water world. Don't think too much about it. We're going to go up to 150% water consumption. Food consumption is going to stay the same. Starting is going to stay the same. Let's get going. I'm calling the settlement Water World. The beavers are out of the house. We're gonna pause, we're gonna take a look at it. So here it is. Literally, Water World. Uh, I, have, I have boxed in the entire map. The entire map is full of water and uh, the occasional, I, I got a lot of water dispensers, whatever you call them. But uh, the idea behind this game is that I want to use the Golem terraforming. I, I couldn't think of another reason to use Golem terraforming unless the map was covered with water. Now even here, I could get the beavers to block off areas and drain the water and use it, but I really want to use Golems to like terraform the land and get rid of most of the water. This is why all the water can drain off here, but uh, we'll see how that, how that works out. If you turn off the water view, you can see that uh, underneath here, I have a couple of spots where the land's a little higher than the base. We do have some metal that we can extract way down here because we're going to need metal for the golems. But uh, other than that, we're going to start off on this little island. And uh, let me turn the water view back on. What is this view? Show storage overlay. Ooh, this is new. There's all kind of new stuff, including the way storage works. It's going to be very interesting. But this is what we start off with. And uh, apparently we don't have any food at first. The berries should come in quickly. This is all the trees we have. We're going to have to plant trees right away. The biggest challenge, I believe, starting off is going to be power because there is very little, if any, flow. And uh, as a matter of fact, I think the flow should be from here down to here and it looks like it's going this way at the moment. But it'll be interesting to see... You can see some flow here. It'll be interesting to see if I can start to wall off something to get some flow to get some power wheels until then we're going to be all beaver and wind power so let's get started with water world and uh, first thing i'm going to do is put a road all around my uh the little starting house here because this gives me time to think and then we're going to have to cut down some trees so check out some of the new stuff here under not landscape Ooh. Dirt excavator, terraforming station, terrain block. This is all good, but we're not there. Under storage, we have the new underground pile where you could must be ground only and you can store logs and you need gears for it. But check out the large pile. Stores bulky resources like logs, but it doesn't have to be on the ground. See how the uh, ground only is gone? Huge. And then the small warehouse, capacity 30. Medium warehouse, capacity 200. The big warehouse... Other buildings can be built on its top. Yep, yep, yep. And uh, this store is 1,200. Small tank, 30. We're used to that. Medium tank. This used to be the large tank, 300. And then the, the behemoth, 1,200 takes 30 metal. So more things you can build later in the game. Labor doesn't change. Does it? What is this? Hauling post. Oh, it's a new symbol. All right. Housing doesn't change. Water doesn't change. Food, I don't see any changes. Wood, I don't see any changes. Metal, nothing. Power, there's the battery, windmill, no changes there. Science, so science, the bots have changed. They're not golems anymore, they're bots. And uh, you have the refinery, manufactures fuel out of food and water. You have the bot part factory. This might be the same. It's just you choose which one. Yeah, and then you have the uh, bot assembler. So we had that before. All of these require metal blocks, which is why I need to get to metal as fast as possible if I'm going to terraform this area. Ooh, I was unpaused. 
Mistakes were made. <laughs> we'll, we'll see how much that cost me. Uh, the mine, the smelter, the scavenger flag. All right, now I'm panicking. First thing I want to do is uh, pump some water for the beeves because they're going to be thirsty and we started out with nothing. So, where do we want? I'm going to pump it off the lake, what I call the lakeside at first. And we don't have to worry about droughts. So let's just put this right here. And let's build a road to it. There we go. And then to store the water, we will have a little water tank. Uh, which is under storage now. That's different. Let's put a small tank in here to store the water. And uh, we'll put it right over here. Wow, that is a small tank. Check that out. You could put two small tanks in. This is small. Oh, this takes gears. All right, this is a really small tank. That's cool. You know how I am about building too many small tanks. And I want to put four beeves in here. There we go. It's Alza, Mazia, Razi, and Sagawa. All right, get this built. You don't have any wood. I'm okay. Everything's fine. Let's put down a wood pile. Small pile. Oh, jeepers, that's small. Larger pile. I mean, we're going to need a lot of wood to start off with. So why don't we put the large pile... It fits right in the middle. I like it. We're going to put the large pile right here. And then we're going to put a lumberjack flag. Let's see. We'll put a lumberjack flag right over here. We'll build a road out to it. And then we'll extend this road later. And then our cut down area. Chop, chop. Chop. Whoops. Chop. And we will start out chopping all these trees. Get all these trees down. As a matter of fact, the whole area has to be chop, chop. These are a, a combination of maples and chestnuts. I figured we'd need a little extra wood to start off with. Okay, maybe we die, maybe we don't. Who knows? I want to get to farming, too. I think the first farm's going to be over here. We're going to have to get to farming. And uh, this should be the highest priority. We're going to go up to speed, too. We got a dude. Boy, you know what? I really need two lumberjack flags, don't I? I think I do. Uh, let's put another one right over here. All right. And you're building this next? Maybe, question mark. Oh. Um. Uh. Logs. Wow, that's cool. So you can store logs there. Construction site. We're waiting for materials. You need logs to build a log storage. Can't get all the required materials. This is okay. This is now high priority. You know, a lot of people don't like playing early access games. I do, especially quality early access games, because they change so much. It's like playing a new game every time. The beavers have gotten thirsty. Does this episode end on the first... On the You know, does this series end on the first episode? Okay, you can store logs now. They're going to the pump. This uh, workplace has to be high. Yep, and Tasia's going in there and it's going to pump. And you're going to do this. I think we'll be fine. Minus 11. Ooh. Well-being. Oh, but they're hardly on the bar. Thirst, 0 of 11. Does it go negative? I don't know. We'll find out. Pumping. Should I put two pumps? How many beeves do we have? We have uh, zero unemployed. We have seven worker beeves. And uh, everything's cool. And you're living outside right now. And I really don't want you to uh, to procreate yet. Oh, I gotta say what's stored here? Uh, water, please. Wow, I can also store maple syrup here. Or I can store biofuel, catalyst, or medicine. Oh, wow. And this is accept goods, obtain goods, empty, obtain. What does obtain mean? Accept, obtain. Can't obtain goods, build a hauling post. Okay. Accept goods. Interesting. I don't know exactly what that means, but it looks interesting. Drink the water. We have water. Drink the water. We don't really have water, but you, should, you could have gotten a drink out of here. I think we'll be all right. I'm a little panicky, so I'm going to build two water pumps. I'm always panicky, but I'm going to build two water pumps. 
and uh, we'll just keep the storage here for now because I'm not sure how much water they're going to drink since I bumped up the water usage. So we'll get two pumps in and your workplace is also going to be higher than normal priority so you get in here first. And we should have been taking out of here, not yet. Starting goods, berries, 85. Oh, thanks for the reminder. All right, we need uh, berry, food, 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 berries, gatherer flag. Put the gatherer flag right here because you're going to be able to gather the berries. All right, how much can this store? Starting goods, 82. I don't know that that can store anything. We have to build a warehouse. Now wait, storage, small warehouse. It's just a little thing. Let's put the little thing right next to here and I'm going to say it can store berries. Is this berries? It can store berries. Now what does this little indicator mean? I think this indicator means how many we have. See how it's full and the rest is empty? You can store berries. Sweet. All right. And then uh, so you pick the berries. No available worker in district. This is also going to have to be higher than normal, which means now we only have three workers here. That's okay. We're getting wood. We have two pumps. Nobody's thirsty. Everything's cool. Did I tell you to cut down all these trees? I did. I need you to cut down all these trees so I can start building farming. What do I need to unlock? Remind me what my unlocks are. The farmhouse is not an unlock, but the woodworker is. The uh, forester is a 60 science unlock. All right, their well-being is zero. So we're starting at zero. I'm going to put in a farmhouse. Let's slow it down to one while I'm doing this. Uh, one farmhouse. I think the farmhouse is going to go out here because I want you to reach over in here as far as you can. So we'll put the farmhouse right here. And then, look, we have a little tree coming up. You know what? That's okay. We don't have a forester. We'll deal with the little trees. And then we're going to uh, plant some crops. And I'd say, you know, carrots are my favorite. They're nice and fast. It'll give us some food. Carrots, wherever we can grow them. How far were you going to reach? The whole way? Yeah, carrots. As far as you can plant. This should keep us alive for now. Between the carrots and the berries, we should be fine. As a matter of fact, when they eat carrots, they'll go above zero. Now, wait a minute. Where are we going to store the carrots? Warehouses. So this is the... No. This is the medium warehouse, which is the same. Uh, this is nice because... Now the berries aren't going to clog it up. So let's go ahead and build a medium warehouse. What do you need? You just need 15 logs. Let's build a medium warehouse here. And what? this can only store one good. Boxes. Stuff. Food. We're going to want to store carrots. All the carrots. Only one food. Isn't that interesting? All right. No, that's fine. Yeah, all carrots. I think that's as many carrots as I want. And this? Zero of 30 berries. This can't help it. And this is just accepting goods. Okay. And here's the farmhouse. All right. Now, we don't have any available workers in the district. We do have plenty of wood. Why don't we set this back to normal and set this up to high? This will put two beeves in. And your harvesting is going to be what's a priority for you. And now let's see the workplaces. Can I see the workplaces? Uh, workplaces. The district center is now empty. Is that what this means? No, it's got three. Gather a flag. Oh, no. Blueberries. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, farmhouse. Uh, carrots. I didn't have to do this. But uh, I'm going to prioritize you for carrots, just in case. Okay. And this means there's no worker for this flag here. Everything else is okay, I think. Water pumps, too. A lumberjack flag. Two of them. One of them's missing a worker. Okay, that's pretty easy to read. I am going to low-prioritize one of these pumps. So we do wood instead. And I'm going to keep an eye on this little teeny water pail here to make sure it doesn't get empty. I like that new graphic. You guys are thirsty. All right. You're going... Whoa. Whoa. Some of them went to the pumps. Some of them went to the barrel. We'll have to see if the one pump can fill this barrel up. 
Uh, you're over halfway full still. 18 of 30. I'll have to keep an eye on that. Alright, we're gonna need science for the planks. One inventor right here. And... Put a little path up here. To the inventor. And we'll go ahead and set this workplace higher than normal. That should be cool. And it does look like... Yeah, uh, yeah maybe two pumps. No, you're almost full. Yeah, and then they go and they, I'm gonna have to really keep an eye on this. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna build another... What do I need for the... Where the heck is it? Storage. What do I need for the bigger water? This takes 20 gears. We're nowhere close to that. Let's put another little water tub here. Looks like you can fill that one. You can probably fill two of them. Then I think we're cool. As long as there's no young beavers, everything will be fine. Now, where's the beaver population? A beaver child, Sligo. 81% to adult. All right, cool. We could use one more beaver. I forgot to set water. We're going to store water. All right, he shows up for work, starts pumping. We're starting out with just 12 water. And you can hold 15 water and then you dump it. 19 water, right? And then, yeah, you're going to town. You can't even dump all 15 in this one now. You gonna visit both of them then? Let's check them out. Faster, 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 faster. Right? You didn't take all of it. So this one's full. I don't agree. Maybe you can only carry so much at once. Alright, it's about halfway through the day. This one's full. How full can we get water... Bucket number two. It looks like he can only carry seven at a time. Because it'll go up to 15 and then it'll remain with eight. And his productivity is going up. Uh-oh, they're drinking the water. But he's still working. It's okay. Somebody came in and stole water directly from him. So not only do we collect berries, we put them in nice little boxes with berry symbols on them. Check that out. Pretty cool. Science is sciencing. I got two water pumpers now. I was not happy with the amount of water that we had. And as soon as we have... What's the science we need for the uh, forester? We need... 60 science for the forester. As soon as we have 60 science, we can make a forester. We have a good number of woods left. We don't have a lot of land. I was debating how big to make this island. Oh, we do have 20 chestnuts. Of course, because we're cutting down chestnut trees. And we do have... What are these? These are chestnuts? Chestnut boxes? Yep. And then maple, I suppose if any maples have resin, maybe they'll collect resin as well. I'm not, I'm not sure about that. I think you have to specially collect the resin without cutting down the trees. Where you collect chestnuts when you cut down chestnut trees. Alright, I'm going to put in a uh, planker and... Oh, I have to unlock the levee. And I can't build on a dam. Mmm... Dear, oh dear. This is in the cut down area. Why haven't they cut down this tree yet? I'm going to have to block off some of this stuff. Anyway, this thing needs power. So, I'm going to put in a little power wheel. Just one beave. Spinning on a wheel. But you got to have a path to it. And uh, this path is blocked by trees. So I guess what I'm going to have to do is uh, get rid of most of this cut down area. So that you will cut down just these trees here, please. And quickly. Whose job is it to pick up the log? Pick up the log. The log. Pick up the log. Thank you. Alright. Now let's uh, let's recreate our cutting zone. And sure, cut up here first. Alright, I'm going to want to store planks. So let's go to storage. And uh, this can store 20 planks? No, sorry. This can store... Wait a minute, what can this store? Can this thing store planks or have they been moved? Ah, planks have been moved to bulk goods. I kind of suspected that. Okay, so we need a small pile, right? No, a small pile. 20. Yeah, let's store 20 planks. I can put them side by side because they're kind of a waste of space. 
Uh, this is my water. We have plenty of spots for water. I'll put it this here. And we'll put a road down to it. And you're gonna store... Yep. Planks. See, there's the indicator there. We do have some planks. How about that? Wow, you're rolling. You're rolling. And uh, we're gonna store planks here as well. Planks. Okay. And we have 66 science, just like that. We can unlock the forester for 60. Yes. Alright, and we're gonna want to plant trees and bushes and jazz. And I think I'm gonna stick you pretty close to... where? Where's your reach? Wow, you can reach a long way. What if I put you over here? That's pretty good, actually. Put you back as far as I can. Yep, right there. We'll build a road to you. I'm gonna run out of beeves. Perhaps I should say I'm running out of beeves. And you are going to plant maples, of course. That's well, that's your, gonna be your, your priority. Your workplace priority is gonna be above normal. And I'm going to designate the maple planting zone as anywhere in here. Anywhere you can reach. I forget how far you can reach. Uh, I'm going to need a zone for... Hmm. I think industry might be over the water. I think anytime I can build over the water, I need to build over the water. You know what I'm saying? Let's put maples there for now. Maybe industry will go in this direction. I've already got one power wheel here. Yeah, I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll get you planting as fast as you can so that we don't run out of wood and I built a road over to you so really we should build a wood cutter over here then lumberjack flag over here rotate right uh, yeah I can build you over this right here possibly two but this will be low priority and this will be higher priority. And then as far as the cutting cutting tree zones go, yeah, it's gonna be wherever we plant, we're gonna cut. And this required seven planks and 10 logs. And we've got them, we've got 10 planks. Oh, look at the bar. Shows how full storage is. Nice, we're completely full of chest. Oh, I don't have a little warehouse for chestnuts. Well, let me build a little warehouse for chestnuts. Small warehouse right here. It can hold 30. That's why the chestnut boxes are all over the place. See, a larger warehouse, a medium warehouse for chestnuts would be better. But the small warehouses are so cute. Let's put them over here. <laughs> we'll put one for chestnuts. It's going to store chestnuts. Chestnuts, chestnuts. Uh, these are chestnuts, right? These are grilled chestnuts. So this is food. Where's raw chestnuts? Um... Chestnuts. Here we are. Ingredients. That's what that means. Raw materials or whatever boxes pr produced. Lightweight produced goods. Sure. Uh, ingredients and edible foods. So I think the costs have changed. Wooden stairs are 70. Platform is 100. Levees are now 120. Wow, and I want to unlock a levy. So, we're going to have I'm going to have to get more science. And our wood pile's full. No, it's not. 87 out of 180. Wood pile's not full. Look at all the carrots in boxes. Ready for shipment. We're probably short on Oh, we're short on builders. All right. Let's see. I have this as lower priority. Why? Let's see here. We have plenty of logs. Where did I put my log cutters? You remember? They were somewhere. They're right here. Alright. Sligo, you're out. And Zala, you're also low priority. Does this give me at least... Sligo, you're in here now? That's cool. We only really need... We really don't need either one of these. 20 of 20 logs in stock. Let's go ahead and pause this. And let's go ahead and pause this. Yep, I'm juggling beavers, so to speak. The chestnuts are in. 
in their custom little boxes. Chestnuts. And see, the water's full. So these guys are both idling. So I'm going to set you to lower priority again. Or really low? I don't want to pause you, so I'm going to set you to really low. So you go here and help build some stuff. I'm thinking, what's the minus eight? Whoa, thirsty. Well, go get something to drink. I can't help it that you... I understand that I bumped up the thirst, but... And we'll see. There's plenty to drink. Do I need to move waters around? Oh, maybe that's it. We'll have to see how that works out. That looks really cool, too. The new storage. Apps, fantastic. It really is. It really adds something to the game. All right, you're working. Eventually, I'm going to turn you off, dude. Because I don't know that we need all these planks. We have 26 planks. Playing around with the priority. Your workplace priority is now lowest. Which means you guys should go here. For builders. Although I'm not building that much stuff. I'm building shy. I think I need more science. I think that's what's holding me back. 57 science. I'm going to do one more sciencery thingy. And I'm going to put you right next to the other one. And I have you above normal priority. I'm gonna have I'm gonna keep you as normal, which means somebody should go in. I think. And yeah, Azia is gonna help us with some science. Because I think Yeah, we're gonna wanna build over this pond here. Because I need all the dirt space I can get. But what's cool is I can build this over the pond as well. This no longer has to go. Oh, look, the water's flowing this way now. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, this is just the distance graphic, I think. Water's definitely flowing around the island here. Hmm. See, my thinking is, I've got carrots, which, by the way, they aren't planting them. They're just harvesting them. So, I think what I'm going to have to do is be... I think we're full. Let's be a little twitchy about this, too, and prioritize planting. Get, like, half of them planted. And then I'll flip them back to harvesting. No, we're not even close on carrots. 65 to 200. Okay. Let's just get some carrots planted. Then I'll flip you back to harvesting. But since we, I think we're going to have plenty of food, uh, maybe industry goes here. I'm going to... Oh, I can't put in a water wheel here. Can I? Let's try it out. Water wheel. I can put one right here. Power connection is blocked. Yeah, it really needs to be raised up. I didn't think about that. I didn't give me enough ledge on this side. On purpose, of course. You are now no goods in stock, so I can delete you. Oh, that's right. I get stuff back. New delete animation. Ready? Shift. Poof. I don't know how much I got back. It didn't say. But I got something back. And you, you guys planted all your carrots really quick. Oh, you plant a lot faster than you harvest. All right, I'm leaving it on planting them. I'm going to put in one more berry hut, <laughs> berry warehouse, just so we can get all the berries out here. Might need to put two in. Hmm, I've got one here. Yeah, I can put another one in. And then as soon as they pick all the berries, I'm going to tear out the berries. This will stock us, just in case. And I bet you I never use them and end up having to delete them. Okay, when it first gets built. See, it's empty. There's no berries in here and it's empty. So that's cool. I don't know. It looks like one berry. No, it looks like there's some missing boxes. It's not stacked as high. Yeah, see, this one's missing. See that? Because it's not full. That's pretty cool. So it's going to track how many berries are in here. So they get thirsty. And this drops to negative eight, and then it ticks back up. Interesting. I'm thinking the carrots aren't giving them any well-being. Carrots is just plus one. Shelter is minus three. Maybe that's why it goes down. Sleep plus one, thirst plus one, hunger plus one. And then sunflower seeds. Why don't you show me? You're not showing me what it offers. I still wish it showed me so I knew what to target. Well, we'll, we'll create more stuff soon. 
We need more storage for chestnut. Oh, small pile. Ooh, I forgot about this. We don't need we don't need a small pile yet. I need a small another little hut. You're gonna do chest more chestnuts. Yep. And we may need some more for berries. Right now this is full of chestnuts. But I think that should clear it out. And I'm trying to get these deleted, which you're slowly doing it. And then we'll clear this area out. We'll build some housing tentatively for some more beavers, because I think I can support them. We have 155 science, which means I can unlock the levy for 120. Thank you. And then what I wanted to do was the, with the levy is... Well, build some of this out, because I, I would have liked to put the power over here. But uh, eventually then, I'm going to want steps as well. We do, we have 37. The platforms I can unlock for 100, the double for 150. I want to unlock the platforms as well. I, I envision platforms all over this lake. All right, and uh, we're clearing some of this stuff out. This These areas are always twitchy to get to. I'm using the word twitchy a lot. I'm not sure what that means. Let's build a path over in this direction so it's easier to get there. And let's build a path down here so trees don't grow back. All right, well, the little village, a uh, water world, something, is started. Tell me what you think. You think this map's going to end up being fun? I can see... I can see damming off this area. Not really damming, but putting levees around this area to dry it out so we can get to the metal. I think they can swim underwater to get to the metal as well. But to get to the underground mine, I think it has to be above water. So I can see that. That might increase the flow through this channel. You know, we could channel stuff. But the important thing is, is that we can channel stuff all we want to get the power. But to be able to get more food, we're going to have to get to get to golems and raise up the land. And that's going to to be something. This land is probably the closest to the water, so is this to the surface of the water, so is this over here. But that'll give uh, that'll give us good reason to have lots and lots of golems. Control H, of course. I always forget that. Control H to hide the user interface. Our little island in the middle of water world is started. You know, I don't know, I think it looks like fun. It'll, it'll definitely be interesting, that's for sure. Alright, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.